Sometimes I would like to leave everything behind, escape without looking back, change my life completely. It's not that I'm a coward, but since my father died, I'm so tired of this huge house that my mother doesn't understand we should sell. Oh, my mother. What am I going to do with her? Hmm. This afternoon, she got the great idea to invite Marijita de la Casas and the Delatore sister. Uh, Juanita! <laughs> She's so slow. I'm coming, ma'am. I'm not ah. deaf. It's just that the kitchen is far away. I Help yourself. Watch her all the thank time. You. Oh, Mrs. Marujita. Uh, thank you, Juanita. What is that crap, Juanita? Those delicious pastries that you made, where are they? What delicious pastries that I made, ma'am? Don't call me ma'am, please. Call me milady or madam. Very well, madam. This crap, as you call it, is what you ate this morning, and it's all there is. Juanita, please don't tell me. Do we have bugs again? Oh, my God, how awful. Bugs! They always show up this time of year. This is terrible. Call the exterminators immediately and have them killed once and for all. <laughs> uh, the bugs. The bugs. Right. I don't understand these bugs. They've decided to make their home in the fanciest houses in the city, and... They come in through the garden and eat everything. Oh, one spends a fortune at the market, and for what? Oh, how awful. Oh. Camilla, a whiskey sour for table four. Okay, whiskey sour, table four. Hello, Camilla. How are you, Valentina? I see you're still working here. Yes, that's right. Mm, how's your mother? Fine, thanks. Excuse me. My daughter has an important position at the country club. The, the thing is... I really don't know why that university has to make her carry out such silly field work. Flo, I could speak to Nestor. He has much influence with the president of the club. <laughs> that won't be necessary, Marujita. The problem is my daughter wants to work after she finishes at the university, you know, and pursue a career. Although I've told her not to, to do as I did. Got married and dedicated my life to my husband. I take care of our home and enjoy our fortune. <laughs> work? What for? <laughs> um. Yeah, that's very funny. Uh, thank, thank you so much. Excuse. Enjoy. Eduardo. Hello. Hi there. Mm. How, How are, are you? you? Fine. And Why you? didn't you call? I've been waiting. My love, it's just that I've had so much work. Then let's get together tomorrow here at the club. Well, why don't I just give you a call? But call me, okay? Of course, my love. Okay. Bye. Bye. No sabes cuánto mal me harás A qué infiernos me conducirás Cuántos sueños tú me robarás A qué abismos tú me empujarás Mírame, escúchame No me pidas que te vuelva a amar No mereces la oportunidad Mira ya Alejandro is so handsome But sometimes so naive I'm not embarrassed for having done what I did to you. But I know you'll forget. This deserves a celebration. Yes, sir. I sit down for a moment? Hmm. Be my guest. Thanks. So, how do you feel, Alejandro? Very happy. Happy that the court accepted everything we argued and awarded damages for pain and suffering. What more could I ask for? You're a fantastic lawyer, Alejandro. No one had won a lawsuit against that bank in years, and much less a group of retirees. Sir, you have a call from Miss Claudia Quintana. Excuse me a moment. Luisa, could you please tell her I'm in a meeting? No, no, my boy. Talk to your girlfriend. She's calling from so far away. Put her through. Such a pretty young lady should not be kept waiting, huh? <laughs> You're right. Goodbye. Ah, Claudia, Claudia, what's the problem now? Hello? Hello, my love, how are you? Fine, fine, I'm just here with lots of work. And you? How's school? Fine, everything's fine. I'm just a little bit bored. Although you don't believe it, I miss you very much, Alejandro. Don't you miss me even a little? 
Claudia, look, I'm very busy. I have a lot of work to do. Don't call me to tell me that. Hey, hey, don't get nasty. It's just that I feel lonely. I miss you very much. And all I have are my memories of you. Like the last night we spent together, remember? Can I call you in a while? I have another call. Talk to you later. Here you go, your martini. Thank you very much. Thank God that this place has a girl like her around. Perhaps one day you'll let me make a martini for you. Felipe, anything she does is just fine by me. But I feel it's a little early for a martini. It's never too early for a martini. Will there be anything else? A nice smile wouldn't be too bad. Sir, I'll give you some more time to pick something that's on the menu. Excuse me. That woman will never be yours. Forget her. She's beautiful and intelligent. Camilla comes from one of the club's oldest families. She used to be a member and now she has to work as a waitress. But in any case, she's different. Mm -hmm.